An Iraqi delegation is set to visit Qatar for discussions on a liquefied gas deal. Qatar ranks fourth on a list of the lowest risk nations in the MENA region. AI-generated character Mr. Meta is on a visit to Qatar. And finally, Paris Saint-Germain are on the verge of completing a mega transfer for Osman Dembele. Hi, it's Ali. This is The Roundup. Here are today's top stories. Iraq's Minister of Electricity Ziad Ali Fadl announced the forming of a joint committee on Tuesday to discuss gas imports from Qatar. A delegation is expected to visit Doha to discuss providing Iraq with liquefied gas through one of Iraq's ports. This comes as electricity supply has decreased in Iraq due to the suspension of gas imports from Iran. Now, a report by Global Data Regional has ranked Qatar fourth on its list of the lowest risk nations across the Middle East and North Africa region. The list is topped by the UAE, followed by Saudi Arabia, Qatar, and and Kuwait, reflecting their relative stability despite the region's complex risks. As of now, the MENA region faces mounting challenges, some of which include food insecurity, escalating debt, and inflation on a rise. Mr. Meta, an AI-generated character by Chinese company Star Air Technology, has appeared at renowned locations in Qatar in a recent interview with Al Jazeera. Mr. Meta was spotted at the brand new Waldorf Astoria Hotel, as well as the Museum of Islamic Art and Qatar's open theater. The AI-powered character was captured saying welcome to Qatar in Mandarin and later donning the traditional Qatari thobe and ghatra whilst leading a camel by its harness. And finally, Paris Saint-Germain are on the brink of signing yet another striker to their new look front line with a deal for Barcelona's Osman Dembele. PSG already confirmed the signing of Portuguese forward Goncalo Ramos from Benfica as well as Spanish winger Marco Asensio from Real Madrid. The French club have restacked their attack after Lionel Messi left to the MLS, Neymar put in a transfer request and Kylian Mbappe frozen out of the first team. Thank you for joining us. For more of our stories, head over to our website www.dohanews.co. Have a great day.